This is Twit. This is from Li uh, what is it? Lively Verily. V E R I L Y is the life sciences arm under the alphabet umbrella. And apparently we're starting to see some Zika virus in Fresno, California, Egypti mosquito. And so they've come up with this plan. They call it, I love the name, the debug project. <laughs> Uh, by releasing uh, mosquitoes infected with a bacteria called Wolbachia, which is completely harmless to humans. But when those mosquitoes mate with the Egypti mosquitoes, they infect them and their eggs cannot produce offspring. And it's a way of basically killing off these mosquitoes. And, of course, male mosquitoes don't bite. So now not only do you not have Zika, you don't get mosquito bites anymore. Uh, they haven't done it yet. No word from how much it will cost. Uh, and, I, you know, it's interesting because this is pure public service. I don't think there's any way to make money on this. Uh, they plan to do it in Australia. They told the MIT Technology Review they plan to do something similar in Australia next. They want to... Yeah. I guess this will happen... Let's see. This article uh, is in TechCrunch on July 14th. And they say, so I guess it will happen this coming week. One million mosquitoes over a 20-week period in two 300-acre neighborhoods in the Fresno area. Huh. Yeah. And Why would Google do this? Why does Verily do this? Is there a way to make money on this, yeah. or is it just it's goodwill? It's data, right? Google's currency is data. Like, this will teach them a lot about deploying similar things in the future. And we've actually, I think I've heard about not the exact same thing, but other methods of, like, trying to wipe out the Zika-infected mosquitoes by using, you know, other other species or other ways to, like, mm -hmm. make their mating kind of, you know, kill off whatever is there. That's very cool. Yeah, and Google didn't didn't actually, they didn't, like, do the research for this. They're just using research that other people have done. We've uh, done the same thing uh, to try to get rid of dengue fever. Um, and uh, I don't know how to pronounce some of the other viruses chicken, that mosquitoes can yeah. transmit. Say again? Yes. Chikungunya. So chikungunya, okay. dengue, and Zika are all carried by the same type of mosquito, whereas malaria is carried by a different type of mosquito. We got to just kill all the mosquitoes. I think there's no reason why mosquitoes... Is there any justification <laughs> for mosquitoes to exist? I, so I, I'm one of these skeptics on this. There have been some people who say mosquitoes are not like a keystone species. If you kill them, no other species will die off. Um, because that's always that's always the worry, right? Yeah. Are there mm -hmm. other species that feed on this particular... Well, bats and, bats and birds eat mosquitoes. Bats and birds, right. But we really don't know where else... I mean, it's just such a hard thing to study, yeah. right? Like the, the the ecosystem does not lend itself well to the kind of typical scientific studies we do where we isolate one or two things and we, you know, use controls right. because it's such a web of stuff. Right. So you don't know until you start to see the outcomes. Um, and the other thing with using these sort of... Um, infertility type of tactics is they're not 100%. So if you release male mosquitoes that are infected with bacteria into an environment and they mate with the females and the female eggs are no longer viable, that will take care of a good number of mosquitoes, but it's not going to kill off the entire population. So does it, does it die out? Does it dip? If it dips, how long does it dip? If they come back, do they come back more resilient? You know, which of the, which of the animals survive? It's there's just so many questions. You're, that you're right. I take me, it back. You're absolutely right. It makes right. me very hesitant. So I'm glad that they're just yeah. testing on a little population like Fresno. Well, Omega Project says next summer we'll have a story about 20 million bats being released in the Fresno area to control the, the out of control mosquito population. And when you have the bear to kill off the last one, you just wait till it's winter. You you're, you're absolutely right. This is very human, this godlike thing. Oh, you know, just get rid of mosquitoes. What, what good could they possibly be?